Alright, welcome back to Final Fantasy X, and you're heading off somewhere. I think to the far plane ish ish I guess. Yuna just got asked to be married by yeah, Mr. That too. Seymour. Crazy, isn't it? Yuna, the High Summoner's daughter. Seymour. I mean, when you see all the crazy things you've seen so far. It's down. Overcoming <laughs> marriage at a time like this? It would give Spira something cheery to talk about. Sounds a little, uh... Sounds he was crazy like or, or daydream, like Oren says. Up stuff with pork. <laughs> Come on, let's just get on with the pilgrimage. I mean, marriage. And Titus is just like boo to that. Well, that's because no he way. wants to marry Yuna. We got to defeat maybe. sin. <laughs> Romance can wait. You sure picked a fine time to lay this one on us. Maybe it is a fine time. You serious? If my getting married would help Spira? If it would make people happy. If I could do that for people, maybe I should do what I can. I never imagined doing anything like this. But I won't answer till I know what's right. Seriously? You could always just quit your pilgrimage and get married. <laughs> I will. Go on. I'm sure that Lord Seymour will understand. Um... I guess so. I am a summoner. I must so fight I must and defeat sin. Like Braska before you. Even if I don't want to. I had to stop myself After from shouting. All. What's there to think about? I'm going to the far plane. I'm going to see my father and think on this. Go on. We'll be right behind you. Mm. I wondered why none of the others ever asked Yuna. Do you love Seymour? Do you even like him? In this point in the game, it doesn't matter if you like him or not. Seymour gonna do what Seymour gonna do. Seymour wants some of that, some Yuna. Some of that Yuna booty. Alright, there we go. I'm like, come on, let's go to the far plane. And we've already mentioned what the far plane is, but if you want a fresher. It's basically uh, where everybody goes whenever they die, and you can see that, and you can see them there when they're dead. Mm -hmm. Question about this far plane: When somebody dies, a summoner sends them to the far plane, right? So their souls, or whatever they are, uh, yeah, their souls. They go to the far. Pretty plane, much right? chill there. But pretty that's much. the far plane we're going to, right? And Yuna's old man's there too. Do dead people live there or something? Hmm. Kinda, sorta. Not really. <laughs> you thinking those funny thoughts again, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> well, let's face it. If someone told you we'll you were going to the far we plane where dead people are, you might be a little freaked out too. Being consumed by dead people. Yeah, that's what I would think too if I was in that situation. Aron, though, he, Aren't you he not going. He ain't gonna go look I at the past. There. He also don't feel comfortable. Mm -hmm. You're scared. Searching the past to find the future. This is all that is there. I need it not. And you Riku ain't go. going either. You're not really going to see the dead. More like your memories of them. And Riku kind of explains it too. And the fireflies react to them. That you're not. They take on the form of the dead. You're not person. actually seeing and your dead you relative. You're else. just seeing your memories of them. Hmm. The fireflies take shape. Well, have fun. Mm. Of what? your uh, dead, of like the relative, of the person you're thinking of. Pretty much. Well. Keep my memories inside. Huh? Memories are nice, but that's all. Do they ever explain why Riku wouldn't go there? Like who? She, she doesn't. She wants to. Sort of. She's being private about it. That's literally it. She pretty much says the pa her memories are her memories and that's all and they're just memories. There's like there's no real point in going and sharing your own your personal thoughts. Which I can kinda get. I'd believe it too. Plus also maybe there's nobody there that uh who wants to see or anything. Or maybe there is. And oh, and there's a... We finally get to see what Waka's brother looks like. And he looks nothing like Data's. Well, maybe they'll make him look a little bit more like him in this game. Maybe. What the... You never know.
No, oh, and there's Yuna's mommy and daddy. Mm -hmm. This is the bar plane, guys. One big empty space. Kind of sucks. I always. I want my money back. I mean, I think it's kind of strange. Oh, never mind. Look at that place. Like just kidding. Look? It's a pretty good. It's a pretty nice looking place. I mean, it just didn't it. look like it from far away. Yeah, you just gotta actually walk over to the edge and peer down. What do you think of the guac? Mm. Good guac. The far plane. Was <laughs> cool, far plane was cool. But but I couldn't stop thinking about. Couldn't stop thinking about you. Seriously, Her we have like the best guacamole so and the best salsa again. right now, and it's but amazing. It got me worried that maybe seeing them. I can tell you're hungry. Really <laughs> well, you put chips and dip in front of someone and offer it them to them. Well, what else are you going to do? Ignore it? Exactly. Mm. So it's pardon all the chomping and the crispy sounds. Oh yeah, yeah, there Hello, he is. Chapu. Chapu. Meant to come see he early, looks nothing yeah? like him. Sorry. At least you can kind of see what me. he looks like in here. Huh? Gave up like game. in the original, you can I'm barely tell. This guy looks a lot like you. Showed up. Traveling with him, I thought maybe. Okay, maybe he does a little bit. Yeah? Now that we can actually see him, what his freaking face looks he like. On the far plane. He's like in the. If I was a 10, you really couldn't. So, thinking about it, he was kind of all been? pixely. Oh, that guy I just yeah, but about. that was pretty much everything in Final Fantasy X. He likes it. Huh? Wow. And now Brotherhood's gonna get a bit of a power up. Sweet. Yeah. He is dead, and I am still alive. Coming oh, here really okay. makes that clear. I should focus more on what I have to do now. <laughs> what? I'm not even sure what I'm saying. Don't you mean that you should leave Chapu behind? I'm sure he was a great guy, but don't be others. Hmm, that's a possibility. Hmm. How about mm, Waka? What, me? With Waka? Yeah, you two get along great. <laughs> Getting along isn't enough. Not even close. It's funny, oh, cause sorry. 10 too. <laughs> My mistake. <laughs> you do well to remember that. Knowing a bit about women might come in Should handy Should we just spoil it? Nah. Yeah, I'll remember. Okay. I won't be forgetting either. Goodbye, Chapu. You always said I looked grumpy. But those were the happiest days of my life. Though it kind of makes, though I do wonder how many years passed between ten and ten two. I have no idea. That's a really good so, question. Uh, Yuna, I've decided. Uh, oh, really? I have to Google it. Yeah, that's good. I remember. I'm gonna Google it. When I was only seven. Yeah, I'm not sure what the time difference is between it. My I'm gonna say a couple of years. Soon, well, the best way to look at it out in the streets. is literally Everyone going back. Laughing. They and looking up, so actually, happy. uh... I think they if put you as ages in it. That would make everyone happy. Okay. When Two you... years, because she's 19. Uh, I must do what everyone mm -hmm. wants. Not just so, what yeah, I it's want. Two years. Let's go okay. back. Since the events the first. You gotta tell Seymour. Huh. Before Thinking that, about that, then. Call Sir wow. Jack. Guess... Give it a try. Guess they gotta... Huh? Really into know each other. Liking each other and them. He won't come. Two trying years. not to think about my old Nothing man. wrong with that, it made though. me think about him, of course. See, told you. He isn't here because he's not dead. He's sin. Yeah. <laughs> that means he's alive, you know. What Since if my old Titus man really doesn't is see uh, Jet. What would I say to Yuna? Heck, uh, to everybody Jet's in spirit. Jet's not dead. Well, Boy, and kind of like you just said, he's I technically not for him dead. Anyway. He's I'd sin, but he might as well be again. dead. Yeah. What? makes you hate him so everything he does just makes me mad it was his fault that me and my mother uh, oh and there's Tyus's uh, mommy mom uh, it, it's her she's very pretty uh, I would say I'm like and Titus looks nothing like her but, but you see the flashbacks he does right. have brown hair so no he probably just dyed his hair blonde for. Bleached it more like it's, you don't dye your hair blonde, you okay, bleach it blonde. He bleached his blonde. Either that or he's wearing a wig. That's my mother. That would be pretty damn funny. Oh, 
I'm to sorry. pay much or not mm. to pay much? That's that is okay. the question. But yet, uh, his I mommy also just... isn't really winning any Mother of the Year awards either. And I think we've explained what? this like three or four times why? since yeah, we started but doing this. Now we're going to see why. And. See, so I told him what I thought of him right there. What? Really? Of course. <laughs> I suppose, but... Hmm. Mommy! Just a sec, dear. Whenever my old man was around, my mother wouldn't even look at me. Maybe that's when I started to resent him, even hate him. Oh, when he sense. left us, Mom just lost her energy. Is she all right? Why should she care? If she dies, I wouldn't know what to do. Don't say Mom is gonna die. I apologize. The old lady next door told me, when a lovebird dies, the one left behind, it just gives up living so it can join its mate. It was just like that. I hated my old man even more. That is really sad, though. But really, my old man... Mommy! Just, just a sec, sec, dear. Ah, uh, go to him. You'll cry if you don't. It's very sad. <laughs> so, yeah, that's like... Sort of the big main oh, reason man. why uh, hmm? Titus hates his daddy. So stupid. I don't think. And I mean, so. to a degree, he has the right to hate both of no? his parents. He has the right, but he doesn't really hate his mother. No. I know that's I'm the really problem. It's like he he I should be able to hate his mom too, though, because she <laughs> did put him through some stupid stuff too. Yeah, whenever hubby was around, she just always kind of pushed him off to the side. And that's no, there is no way a parent should ever do that to their kids. Thanks so it's just kind of weird that he I'll doesn't like hold any resentment to her. It is. Because you get, whenever something like that happens, oh, you get blinded. Oh, snap. Looks like oh, someone's coming out oh, of the far just, play. Oh, God. Oh, no. It's just like it we imagined. It's the Why? zombies. Zombies! Well, more like ghosts, I think. I'm kidding. I was going to say, more ghosts like. Walks like a zombie. Well, he is very old and dead. Lord Jiskel. He is Lord Jiskel no more. Send him now. Yeah, if we don't send him. He's gonna turn into a fiend. And, that and then would... he'll eat everybody. And that would never end well. Oh, and he dropped something. The question is, what? You can actually tell what it is in this game too. It's a. We leave now. <laughs> or I'm just like I, I want to go. Get out of here what? right now. What was that just now? That really Lord Disco? Wait, I know. He wasn't sent, so he became a fiend, right? <laughs> I would think that he was sent once, but he stayed on Spira. Something, a powerful emotion could have bound him to this world. Such things happen. That's against the rules, isn't it? It means he died an unclean death. Look how they are is just staying in a perfect group as they walk. <laughs> <laughs> they're all walking at the exact same pace. Pretty much, and they're like hitting each other. Anyway. But anyways, we're gonna cut the episode off here. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Please like, comment, subscribe for more. I do videos like this every Ooh, other day. Chest. Talk to you guys later, alright? Bye-bye.